What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Need for Speed Hot Pursuit Remastered. Today we're going to pick up with another racer episode. Looks like we've got two new events here. Go ahead and jump into Eagle Crest up here. We're going to do the Ultimate Rogue Car. It is a preview. We're going to be driving the McLaren F1 it looks like. Let's go ahead and jump into that. We've got our choice of color. Hit the B button on accident. So we've got our choice of color. We're gonna stick with the orange. Designed classic by Gordon color. Murray, the McLaren. Jump right into it. All right, so we've got three minutes and eight seconds to get up to the finish line to get the 8,000 bounty. Let's go ahead and get rocking and rolling. So this car is 620,000 bounty to unlock. Currently have 140,000, so. Sounds good, that's for sure. Feels really good driving it. Feels pretty planted. Some of the boosts we got here. Six and a half miles left. Out of the turn. Alright. Just gonna take that shortcut, but decided too late to try to take it. Can't take that one. I think it's just a continuation of that other one. Yeah, this car does sound really good. Build up some, some nitrous here. We got three and a half miles left, and about a minute to get there. Windy road going back down. ideal. Just keep it going. Again, I'm not going to be, you know, too upset if we don't get gold. It's what we want, obviously, but if we don't get it, we don't get it. Stress out too much, playing the game for fun. Should hit the handbrake there. Like we're gonna get gold. They don't feel like we had like an awful run, so it's crazy that um, we were that far off of gold. We almost didn't get silver, so. Again, I don't play this game enough to become super in it, so I'm just gonna take it as it is. Got 148,000 bounty. We need 157 to get a new car. All right, so let's jump down here. We're going to go to Memorial Valley into Sidewinder. It is a time trial, 4.2 mile time trial. Looks like we get to pick our car here. 
So Camaro is probably our fastest one still. It seems to be. So we're gonna jump back into it. Take out a nice red. Even the light. This time. So we have a minute and 42 seconds to get the 8,000 bounty. Let's see what we can do if we can get there. All right, we'll jump into it. So again, we're we got 4.2 miles to go. We've got a minute and 42 seconds to try to get there. So this car drives a little differently than the F1. Oh man, this thing feels like a boat. Not off to a great start. In theory, we probably should have went ahead and just restart there, but we'll see what happens. This thing feels like such a boat compared to the F1. As it should. I mean, the F1 is a a production race car, right? And this thing, nothing more than a, a sports car, muscle car. Ooh, okay. Almost did make that turn. Just up a little bit of that nitrous around this turn. Oh, gosh. This thing feels so heavy to drive. Alright, we got two miles and about 40 seconds to get there. It feels so slow in this car too. It's crazy. Just a shortcut here. Uh, should have taken that one probably. Completely out of nitrous right now. Got about a half mile left. 10 seconds to get there. It looks like we're going to be getting another silver. Oh, we might be getting silver. Oh man, we barely got silver there too. Daggum. Again, I don't feel like we were driving that awful. I understand we had a slow start. Hit a few walls. But I don't feel like we were driving awful enough to just barely get silver. Let's see. We got a new car. Alright, let's go ahead and see what this new car is. It's going to be a BMW M3 E92. Nice looking. Alright. Let's go ahead and jump up here. Box Layer Pass. It's going to be a duel for complete control. So we'll be able to pick the Audi TT RS or the 911 Targa 4S, I bet. I think we have both of those unlocked. Uh, we do not. Okay. I think we have the 911 as the cop car unlocked. So, jump to the TTRS here. Gonna get a nice midnight blue. Alright, so we gotta come in first to get the 8,000 bounty. Uh, come in second, we get the 5,000. We'll definitely redo this one until we get first, though. I just don't like the time trials. I think. I, I've always just disliked time trials in racing games. I would much rather just race. Alright. Jumping in here. He already wrecked. Well, it looked like he wrecked. I like his car a lot better than mine. I'm not gonna lie. He's staring into me. Yeah, we'll say I was trying to run him off the road, but... A little slipstream action going on here. Go ahead and sideswipe that van. Pulling. 
So I have that van as well. Got to cut it inside. Just didn't get enough. Enough to the inside. Dart through this shortcut there. So still got almost five and a half miles left. Got plenty of time to try to catch up. Let's get in oncoming traffic. Try to get our boost build back up. All right, let's hit our top speed. We're slipstreaming and we're boosting. I'm not gonna waste all the boost because he's just gonna catch back up here in a couple seconds. Maybe some more since we're cool. Coming for 4,000 yards there right now. Get some boost going. Oh, I don't like those hills. Can't see over them well enough. Got two and a half miles left. And he is hanging in there. Those hills are like legitimately terrifying me. And I'm just gonna whack a head on car, or whack a car head on. After I come in over the crest, one of those. Alright, got one mile left. Or a minute, or a second and a half ahead of him. Build up our nitrous here. Good. Use it all. Get across the line. There we go. That was easy enough. So we have got there. Three minutes and 38 seconds. Got the gold award on that one. Alright. 8,000 bounty there. We're not going to get enough to get a new car, I don't believe. Nope. All right. Let's see here. Got another one at Fox Lair. So we got another another preview. We'll go ahead and run this one. It's in the 911 GT3 RS. Um, it's called Extreme Truth. We'll go ahead and run four races on this one. Ooh. I like the gray. All right. All right, so we need to get there in three minutes to get the 8,000 bounty. Looks like it's going to be rainy conditions at three o'clock. Mm, car looks nice, though. I don't know about the red rims, but I'll take that paint job any day. Maybe just not on the red rims. All right, car feels good. Feels light. What you want in a race car? Let's go ahead and take it off road. Just barely came out of not hitting that fence. Alright, back onto the road. Here we go. Got six miles left. About two and a half minutes to get there. This car feels good. I like it. This is one of my dream cars. I would love to have a. A GT2 or a GT3 RS. I just love the way um, they look, they sound. They are quite expensive, so definitely a dream car at that. But, you know, maybe one day, money ever permitting. Definitely wouldn't be a, a daily driver, that's for sure. But something to have fun with on a, a sunny day. Alright, three and a half miles.
miles left in about a minute and a half. We're making good time so far, I think. That's why I hate time trials, because there's really no way to mark or pace yourself as far as just try to drive as fast as you can. You never really know if you're doing good. Some games have ghosts, which is helpful. Um, this one doesn't seem to, at least from where I'm at right now. I don't know if maybe I had friends on the auto wall or auto log, whatever it's called, if it would give me a ghost or not, but... A mile and a half. In about 40 seconds. Thirty seconds, twenty-five now at about a mile. I don't know that we're gonna make it, especially if we hit that. Oh, this! All that for nothing, man. The steering—I feel like it pulled me into that. All right, well, let's see if we can make silver at least. If silver is only ten seconds longer, I don't know that we're gonna even make silver. Yeah. Oh, we got silver. Barely, but we got silver. I feel like the steering just absolutely pulled me into that wall. I was definitely holding to the right, and it just pulled me right into the wall. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, we should unlock a new car here. Alright, new car. So we'll get another new car at 195,000 bounty, along with a new rank up. Let's see what the new car is. Aston Martin DBS Vol Volante. All right, nice looking car. Another convertible, but we'll go ahead and end it off there. We'll pick up next time with a another cop or police episode. If you guys did enjoy, if you did, leave the video a like down below. Um, also, if you want to stay up to date with um, the remaining Need for Speed Hot Pursuit Remaster videos, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Um, and we'll be posting them on alternating days with different um, different games. So I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, again, make sure you're subscribed and leave a like on the video, and we will see you in the next one.